so I knew right away that there were going to be some problems. I mean, I don't know. This wasn't going to be another film project that we were going to work on. We were going to BS our way through another assignment. You know, you guys, I think we should go at this as a very cinema verite style. We just set up the camera outside, set up some lights, something's, something's bound to happen. I mean, honestly, like, that, someone's got to break it. That is the worst idea I've ever heard. You want us to set up a bunch of cameras and wait for someone to rob us? Yeah, I do. Dude, that's totally bullshit. Like, it's not gonna happen. That's like trying to, like, set up a conversation in a room and expect to get some sort of brilliant script out of it. It's just like, it's not happening. It's a total waste of tape, man. Just wait, something's gonna happen, I'm telling you. I, something's gotta happen. No, it's a total bullshit way to make a movie. You know, I thought we could just wing it, but fine. I'll make some damn storyboards. Jeez, I'm just so... I thought we could... Hey, Whoa. hey, hey. Can you please come back in like ten minutes? Oh, right. Oh, carry on. Okay. See? I told you. So obviously our first meeting wasn't very productive, as it ended in Mark beating Ben in Mario Kart. But the important thing was, Ben was going to make us some storyboards. No real plan for how we were going to shoot this film. No budget and very little time. Well, we set out into the production process. We need to collect a bunch of things for the first assembly shot of the house. Get the tripod, the steady cam, and the jib. So, Ben, do we really need the jib for this first shot, or do you think that we could just tripod it, get away with that for the opening? No, Ben's right. Jib makes everything look way more professional and just, uh, you know, style is key, right? I guess. I mean, come on, look at this thing. It's amazing. You can just move it and film the wall, and it wouldn't even matter. Gosh, this thing is so nice. Oh, I wish I had one of these. Man, this is gonna give me a good grade. Check this out, guys. I can move this around, spin it around, everything looks sweet. We should have the burglar do this. Definitely. Okay, so what we're going to need is the key light here is a little bit lower. We're going to need to bring that up so we get our space. The fill light's kind of bright. I don't want to overexpose the shot, so let's tone that down, right? Well, it's a big deal. All we need is a street light and some moonlight. Aye, or else one must come in with a bush of thorns and a lantern and say he comes to disfigure or to present moonshine. Oh, that's great. Did you get that? Yeah, but what does that have to do with anything? It just sounds good. People like that kind of shit. Well, finally, we captured all the footage we needed. It was looking pretty decent, but uh, well, here's where the real BSing began in the editing room. All right, so I've been working on some basic cuts here. I don't know what I'm going to do with this one, though. It's, it's not very good. Let's take a look at it. See, I don't know. The, it's just a little dark, and I could, I guess I could deinterlace and color correct and whatever, but I, I just don't know if we can make it work. What if it's supposed to look correct? crappy. What if it's like a security camera shot, you know? I think this can work. Like, honestly, I think it would fit better with my my project. I don't know. I did, I'd be a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> okay, but whatever. Take a look at this shot, though. I mean, what are we, what are we gonna do here? Wait, See, I don't know. I think we maybe want to do something here with the case. I just what, can't even see what's what, in it. What if we made the briefcase glow like there was gold in it or something? That'd be like straight out of Pulp Fiction. What a ripoff. You know, you know, Jean-Luc Godard. Quentin Tarantino ripped off stuff from Jean-Luc Godard. You know, we could totally do this and it would work because it's using it in their own, our own art form. Whatever. So, well, aside from ripping off Shakespeare and Quentin Tarantino, I had to admit, our project was looking pretty nice. All we had left to do is just some smoothing over in the studio. Alright, I want some intro music for this scene here. Can I get some classical documentary how-to xylophone music? Uh, yeah. 
Yeah. Go ahead and try the keyboard. How does that work? Oh, that's great. That oh, live okay. aspect will just be awesome. Yeah, and then I was thinking for the uh, the burglar shot, um, I kind of want to use the, this audio from this little clip here. I'll show you. Oops. Um, this part right here. Guys, listen. Uh, we got to get out of here. We got to get to class. Ben, come on. Mark, can you just drop the uh, can you just drop the footage off? Finish yeah. it up and drop no, it off for us over at Oxford. Go. Right, let's go. Huh? Hi.